Aunt Jerry is an amazing lady. Okay, she isn't really my aunt, but growing up, Aunt Jerry is all I ever called her. She's now somewhere around 90 years of age. In her younger days, she experienced a terrible amount of tragedy. First was the loss of her husband, who I simply remember as being a gentle giant, a man of deep conviction and personal faith. Several years later, her married daughter was tragically killed in a car accident. In spite of the tragedy she faced, one word comes to mind when I think of Aunt Jerry, and that's the word peace. The quiet, pleasant smile on her face has seldom changed in the 50-some years that I've known her, or perhaps that she has known me. Several years ago, I ran into Aunt Jerry and asked her, what was the secret of your peace? And she said this, it's not a secret, it's a person. It's Jesus in me. There's no way that I can explain the quietness that I feel in the middle of the storms of life. The secret of peace is found in our relationship with Jesus Christ. He is our peace. When Jesus is our Savior and Lord, and as we grow to become more like him, his peace becomes very real to us. The more time we spend with him, the more time we spend reading about him in the Bible, talking to others about him, the more we begin to mirror his life in our life. Things like sickness, financial difficulties, and danger may be real and may actually present a clear and present threat to our well-being. But when we see Jesus and follow his example, the Prince of Peace reassures us. He assures us that God holds our lives in his hands. We can trust that God is on our side. Romans 8.28 says, And we know that in all things God works for the good of those who love him, who have been called according to his purpose. Have you ever experienced this peace? This peace that goes beyond logic and understanding? Do you have the inner confidence that God is in control? My prayer for all of us today echoes the words of those of the Apostle Paul in 2 Thessalonians chapter 3, verse 16. May the Lord of peace himself give you his peace. No matter what happens, the Lord be with you all. Hey, thanks again for joining us today. If you'd like to talk to me or a member of our team, please contact us directly or leave a message in the comments section below this video. You know, we really are better together. God bless you, friends.